Hello traders, so welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to trade over one minute time frame with our strategy. So let's get started. Right now, I'm using Euro US dollar, which is my favorite pair because the volume is quite good in this chart. And if you're using trading with my strategy, then you should look first on this chart only because this is the best chart to get good results with my strategy. That is according to my experience. So I'm using one minute candlestick chart. And currently it looks like that major trend is uptrend and market is a retracing back and I guess market can reverse at any moment of time but it is breaking let's wait and I think we have a trading opportunity here I just need a rejection no rejection till now Okay, we will wait for this candle to finish and uh, let's see if this is going to break the level or not but I can see a good rejection that came on this candle. Let's wait for this candle to finish. I hope I am very sure. Yes, it is going to go up. So I place the trade now. Let's wait for the result low. So let me explain why to straight. So uh, as you can see. The previous candlestick, these three candlestick closes just at the support. This is the support level as you can see here. And this is also here. Let me draw them so that you can see them clearly. So this is the support. Market was, it closes just at the support. And it closes with rejections. You can see the rejection. We also got rejection on this candle. Let me show you the rejection on 5 second. See, this was the rejection but I placed my trade here. Currently we are running in loss. Market is looking like that it is going to break the level. But as this candle closes as a weak one. So that's why I placed the trade. Let's wait. And uh, if market... break this support level market is going to fall furthermore and yes it closes below so i'm going to place a trade i have explained this setup previously also whenever you see a dozy candlestick formation at any level you always wait for the breakout if the next candle breaks the dozy doji support or the resistance level like in this case this is the resistance and this is the support market you can see this candle broke the support level so the next candle needs to fall down as this is also a breakout so the continuation will happen and that's why i place the trade you can apply this trading setup on your trading uh, live trading sessions also whenever you see these kinds of doji formation you always wait for the next candle if next candle break the support or the resistance level you are going to place a trade according to that breakout as you can see it is falling very smoothly so currently we are we have taken two trades and we are in the loss and this is the next support level as i can see here but market will fall down more so what we will do we are going to find the rejection from the upper levels and I'm just waiting. Yes, we got the rejection. I placed the trend. Now, why I placed this trade? So, as you can see, this is the support zone. Let me draw it clearly. This is the support zone. Market didn't hit this level. It didn't hit this level. It reverses from the upper level. So, market needs to hit this level. Then only a reversal can happen because this is a strong level and a clear touch is required that only we can say that market will reverse right now the clear touch was not present and uh, here if we go by candlestick we can go for a call trade but we have to wait for the market to fall down if this candle closes above this candle then uh, this is the newly formed support level and we should stick with this level also so let's wait for this candle 
the scanner will decide if market will going to respect this level or this is the newly formed strong support level So currently market is indecisive it is trying to go up or down but it is not like very solid okay it's falling now we'll wait for this candle to go further down and see which what are the reactions that are coming from this support level okay great now market is very near to that support level let's see I can see some rejection that are coming it is showing that market is actually supporting this newly formed support level okay again market reverses from this very level let's see how this candle will react again we got a reversal so I guess market is okay it is trying to fall down but at any moment of time market will reverse okay it is now falling let's wait for this candle if this candle finishes above the level market will go in the upward direction otherwise we'll wait but all in all I think we are going to get a trading opportunity in the upward direction so let's wait you can see the rejection it came very quickly and uh, let's wait for this candle okay it is at the support level and uh, it closes as a breakout candle so this is the support also I think we have to wait for this candle to finish this is a strong candle and it is at the support zone so both of these things are against each other it's better not to take any trade in such situation okay it closes as a reversal pattern actually we'll wait for this candle I just need a clear confirmation here yes the rejection came and I placed the trade now this is a reversal pattern market is at the support level I'm using currently now this zone as the support because market respected this zone previously so it's a confirmed support level on a minor scale the last candle was very weak previous candle was strong but it closes just above the level the last candle shows a reversal sign and that's why I placed the trade I got rejections over this candle so let's wait for the result this is going to be the fourth trade of this video and after that we are going to take two or three more trades and current situation I guess we can take more trades if market goes down so it is it, it is not going to happen market is 
moving in the upward direction it's going to be a clear winning trade here market is at the recent resistance this is the recent resistance let's see if market is going to break it or not okay market reverses this is okay it's a triple situation and okay this is a lucky win for me here we'll wait we'll wait for this candle to finish and uh, i'll remove these levels now market is falling very smoothly i think some retracement is required in this case market needs to okay i guess we need to draw some strong level of so this is a valid confirmed trend line here i can see one two and three touches and this is going to be the fourth one so that's why market is respecting this level this is at a support level we are going to use this as a potential level i'm going to draw a support horizontal level as well here it start from here and we can include the wick so this is the whole zone of support but we are not going to require this one so let's use this one okay market is trying to break a rejection is required here last candle was weak let's wait for this candle okay market okay again you can see it it is going to close above the level let me remove this it's kind of messy will include this one so it closes a weak candle and market will go in the upward direction i just need a rejection here a confirmation is required yes so i place the trade uh, now let me explain you why i took this trade and uh, it's a simple setup this is a trend support level and it is at the horizontal support level market you can see it got weak this is the rejection 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 this candle tried to go down but it was not able to this is not a breakout because uh, the trend lines and the support levels are not present on a particular level so don't get confused when you see that there is a body below the trend line as well as the horizontal level this is an area where buyers are waiting and i can see that the the weakness in the market and this rejection this wick shows the rejection and this is also a strong level and it is also present on a bigger scale so we can say that major players will enter with these trading setup and you can see market is now moving in the upper direction so we have taken five trades and uh, i'm going to take one more trade in this video and then we will going to wrap up this session so uh, it's clear now that market will going to reverse in for some time so what we will do we will try to take trades in the upward direction as much as possible right now this is a resistance level as you can see this is a resistance level but if market falls down again we are going to take one more trade using the same level so all in all we want to place our trade in the upward direction here because in this case a retracement or we can say the run of the major trend is required here and it is also a major support trend line so market is again at the support trend line and uh, let's see market you can see it closes just at the level we can expect reversal at any moment but i'm not very sure about this setup right now so we'll wait for this candle to get weaker i can see the weakness here
I'm just removing this. Okay. So this is the trend line and market is at the and you can see it's it is happening i was not sure about the setup and that's why i didn't place the trade but you can see again market respected this level and now we are going to go with a call trade here i just need a rejection this is not the rejection we'll going to use this level only let's wait for this candle to fall furthermore because it will give us some margin of safety here it looks like okay now it's quite near i'm waiting for a rejection here okay market is at the support no i didn't place the trade okay I can see some rejection but it's not clear yet and uh, now I'm waiting for a rejection no rejection till now market is trying to go in the downward direction for some reasons but still i am in the favor of market reversing back in the upward direction let's see if this is going to happen or not constant rejections are coming they are not that strong yes the rejection came and i placed the trade it was quite an a healthy rejection let me show you in the 5 second see this is the power now this is the last trade of this trading session as you can see we have placed our trade on the support level the last candle finishes above the level which means that market is respecting this support level and uh, i i think that market needs to go in the upward direction and that's why i place this trade now currently we are running in loss and it looks like that market is falling quite strongly so we are going to lose this trade i guess so let's wait in the next 15 seconds we are going to have our results So as you can see we have lost this trade and uh, I think uh, we have done enough trades on this uh, session so that is it for today I hope that you have learned something out of this video we'll see you in the next video till then keep trading keep working hard good day